the spirit or the ego? Which one will you follow? Now this morning, let's use our imagination. Imagine a ship sailing through life's unpredictable waters. The captain of this ship is the ego. With a determined gaze, the ego insists, I will find peace once everything falls into place. Then I'll navigate smoothly. But as we all know, the waves of life are rarely predictable and the destination is ever-changing. On another ship, let's imagine, the spirit stands as the captain. With a serene smile, the spirit whispers, Find your peace and then everything will fall into place. This captain, the spirit captain, knows that peace is not a destination, but a compass guiding through every storm. In the end, the ego ship may wander endlessly, waiting for perfect conditions before it starts to navigate properly. Whilst the spirit ship sails gracefully, creating its peace amidst the waves of life. So this morning, my friends, which ship will you choose to captain your voyage through life? Now remember in closing, the ego says, once everything falls into place, I'll find peace. But on the other hand, the spirit says, find your peace and then everything will fall into place. Choose wisely. Yeah, man, a word to the wise.